Okay, so here we have a iPad 3G, 32GB, and a MacBook Pro. Uh, the MacBook Pro is running 10.6.4, Snow Leopard of course, and iTunes 9. The iPad is running 3.2 iOS, I guess it's called now, instead of iPhone OS. Um, I just got done syncing it and backing up everything. This is basically what's going to happen if you run the Spirit Jailbreak on your iPad or iPhone when it's updated to the new the newer firmware, the 3.1.2 or 3.1.3, and try to jailbreak it. So we're going to go ahead and, well, you know what, I'll just go ahead and show you that this is 9.2. And sorry if this looks a little laggy or anything, I am taking it with my iPhone. So as you can see... 9.2 you know we'll go ahead and do that again nine point two okay and then about this Mac oh I'm sorry it's running ten point six point three so not the newest update you know I need to update it but it is running iTunes nine point two now they say the spirit jailbreak is not compatible so we'll go ahead and try it I do use this MacBook Pro for jailbreaking purposes and software purposes at work. I do work at an iPhone shop. So we do a lot of jailbreaking, unlocking, repairing, whatever. So we have Spirit. Uh, this is the newest version. And you know, just to show you that's the newest version, I'll just go to here, type in spiritjb.com. And we'll let that load. And you see, do not update to 3.2.1. This does break spirit. So that's the only reason really on the iPad to update um, is for basically it to break spirit. So we're going to go ahead and download that. Let it download. It's a very fast download. So there's the spirit I just downloaded. Go ahead and open it up. Okay, Spirit ready, iPad 3.2 connected. Hit that little jailbreak button. Go ahead and let the iPad load. Now this is the first time I'm doing this, so I, do, I don't know exactly what's going to happen to it. Um, it might just break Spirit, I'm not sure. Go ahead and see. So it is running Spirit. And of course the iPad's really fast, so I mean Spirit runs in, on it really fast. Um, iTunes just popped up. Go ahead and quit out of iTunes again. Uh, Spirit just got done and it restarted. Go ahead and unlock it. And there's Cydia. Can't really bring it into focus. There we go. This iPhone 4 uh, video camera really works good. Um, as you can see so far, everything seems to be working on the iPad. Um, he says it does have problems. I don't know if that's just the Windows side or the Mac side of Spirit that's having problems with it. So far, I haven't had any problems. I have had a problem with an iPhone 3GS running 3.1.3 .3 jailbroken. Or, excuse me. Uh, it was running 3.1.3 .3 and I jailbroke it with Spirit on a Mac and it basically needed a restore. So I'm not sure what the glitch is exactly. And I'm a hacker plus command line. So it seems to be working fine. Um, I'll test it out for a little bit before I post up the video, I would say. And as you can see, the only reason why I did do this tutorial is because I do have the SHSH files on hand for this iPad on 3.2. It's the only reason why I did this tutorial, else so I wouldn't be. Um, we're going to go ahead and complete upgrade that. So as you can see, everything seems to be working. Uh, that was, I'm not sure, I will probably update to 10.6.4 um, and try this. I do have it on my iMac 10.6.4. But um, as I can see right now, I see no problems with Cydia. It's loading fine. 
Um, if anyone has any problems with City after jailbreaking with iTunes 9.2 installed and Spirit and using Spirit, um, let me know. All right, guys. Thanks. Have a good day.